Cabinet Secretary for Sports, Your Excellencies, Ambassadors and High Commissioners present, sponsors of this uh, great team, Team Kenya, the leadership of National Olympic uh, Committee and uh, the leadership of sports in Kenya. Good evening, fellow uh, Kenyans and athletes. Hamjambo. Sateni sana na karibuni. A round of applause for those great Kenyans who have done a wonderful job. Sports is an integral part of our nationhood and heritage, and we all know that. It captures the Kenyan spirit of resilience, dedication, and lately, innovation. If uh, our closing, opening, and sports team is uh, attire is anything to go by. That we are a sporting powerhouse in Africa, and indeed globally, is not in doubt since our debut in Melbourne in 1956. The recent Olympics in Tokyo, all the way, and was played under um, the recent uh, Olympics in Tokyo that was played under a cloud of um, a dark cloud of COVID. We all remember that Tokyo was subdued because it was held when we had the COVID pandemic. The Olympic greats and legends, the heroes and heroines, over the years remain an enduring reminder of how each one of us can play a part in the two Olympic values of excellence, respect, and friendship to keep Kenya highly positioned and respected in the community of nations. It is true that our sportsmen and women have been the greatest ambassadors of our nation. In fact, many people globally know Kenya because of our sportsmen and women. When our athletes take to the stage at the Olympic Games, they represent the values and ideals of Olympism that thrive on solidarity, friendship, and peace. These are values that we espouse when we beseech us in our national anthem to dwell in unity, peace, as our flag is hoisted up before billions of people on global viewership and spectators when our athletes do their thing. I wholeheartedly congratulate the athletes of Kenya for being at the forefront of service to the nation and take pride in their associated in being associated with these champions on behalf of the 50 million Kenyans. I fully understand that your journey to the top echelons of being champions and Olympians is long and tedious, periled with a lot of personal sacrifice. But that is why you remain the nation's source of inspiration as you continually represent our collective spirit of hard work and resilience. Listening to the two speakers, great Kenyans who spoke here, they speak of the many things that you have gone through, both in Eldoret, in Nairobi, and in other areas as you prepare. The beckoning Olympics in Paris is not a walk in the park. Every nation has prepared its athletes and will be representing and presenting the finest of them all at the Olympics. Today, I take tremendous joy in knowing that we too are sending not just the finest of Kenya, but that of the world. You are our gallant warriors to this sporting challenge and rest assured that the entire nation is behind you in every step of this noble assignment as you unleash your fullest potential at the global showpiece. And I, I have heard you say you will spare no effort. And uh, what uh, my dear sister representing the Paralympics said, that they will do their best. That is, 
That is all we ask. As you are aware, the government did not spare any effort to support your qualification pathway in line with our commitment to support the identification, nurture, and promotion of talents under our Talanta Hela initiative. We will continue this work with you until you come back with a harvest of medals and experiences from Paris, when we shall monetize this with handsome rewards. And I want to promise you that I have given very clear and firm instructions to the ministry to make sure that the reward system represents the excellence that we have in our sportsmen and women, and also the allowances must keep in pace with the excellence that we see in our sportsmen men and women. It is very encouraging to know that we have some six sports disciplines qualified to represent the country in Paris. This is commendable and it goes to demonstrate that with more investment from the grassroots, technical and other support system, Kenya can have a rich portfolio of sports to send to the quadrennial uh, games. And I want to very sincerely identify with the counties for partnering with us as we uh, enhance the pool of spaces where Kenyans can participate in this uh, endeavor. I am also delighted to learn that these games, and indeed our Kenyan delegation, has largely upheld the gender balance consideration, which I applaud the leadership of the National Olympics Committee as I salute NOC for their laudable transformation to a robust, dynamic, forward, uh, forward-looking institution. Let me also appreciate my team at the Ministry of Youth Affairs, Creative, Economy and Sports for bringing to life coherence and predictability to that space so as to make its contribution to the government's youth development agenda a reality. I equally salute the various partners. I know they are here. Uh, Kenya Airways, Safaricom, I think, uh, BAT, Safaricom is here, BAT, EAPL, are they here? Great. I think, uh, is that uh, APSA Bank? Yes, I think I saw APSA Bank. And all our other partners. I also want to thank a representative of our friends from Algeria, from Egypt, from China, from, of course, the host country in France for partnering with us. To them all, I assure that the government has taken cognizance and encouraged the same to continue beyond Paris 2024 Olympics as we also strengthen our reward system for such investments. Today, as I officially unveil the team, Team Kenya that is, including the ceremonial kit, and also hand over to you our national flag as I did shortly. May it be a symbol, an instrument to motivate you to summon all you got to raise it high in Paris and make every Kenyan so proud and inspired to aim for the best in all our endeavors as we celebrate your success. I am very, very proud of the, the team that I see here. And I am particularly proud of the exercise we went into when I asked Ababu Namwamba that it is not fair for us to buy kids from all manner of places when we have Kenyan talent that can craft and curate an outfit that is truly Kenyan, designed by Kenyans, produced by Kenyans, and tailored by Kenyans. I am very proud that that we are doing this time. And look at uh, the young people who have put this together. Can you stand again? You know? That is the kind of talent we have. And it is the reason, please take your seats. It is the reason why we have taken the position that we should not be importing what we can produce locally. I will continue to say this. We cannot possibly be importing um, kids 
you know, the ones you guys are wearing, which can be made in Kenya. We cannot be importing eggs or potatoes or cement or furniture or diapers or bumpers that can be made in Kenya. We must make them in Kenya so that we can give Kenyans, like those young ones there, an opportunity to be designers and an opportunity to be um, uh, the people who produce them. That is how we are going to create a nation that has talent, that has opportunities, that creates jobs, and that creates wealth. Congratulations to the achievement that I see in this space. I will be watching keenly to see how that ceremonial dress designed by uh, uh, those young uh, people there. Yeah, I will be watching to see the ceremony and I wish Kenyans can celebrate the young people who have put this together. We could not ask for more than expect your usual excellent role of being our premium ambassadors as you represent the brand Kenya fully and superbly. And I have no doubt in my mind that we will come back here to celebrate medals and to celebrate your excellence and success. My very best wishes from all of us, the 50 million of us, to you. As you go to Paris, please know that our goodwill, our prayers, our support in every way is right behind you. Uh, many of us may not uh, attend the Olympics. I had been asked by the President of France uh, to attend the Olympics, but uh, unfortunately I will not. But you have my support in every way. We will be right there with you, and I will send a very uh, powerful team to stand with you. And Kenyans will be cheering you from every part of our country, including those who are away. So, asante ni sana. Iyo maneno mumeniuliza ya kuwapanga vizuri, iyo nisha patiana instructions kwa huyu pius. Upange hawa watu wangu vizuri. Asipo wapanga vizuri, mumushitake kwa ngu. Ndajua vile mtafanya. So otherwise, Asante Nisana, God bless you and I wish you well.